hello lovely people welcome back to my channel today we'll be making perfume at home okay you know the heat season the heat is on a lot of people would like to use perfumes on their bodies so that they smell fresh throughout the day so these are our supplies our raw perfume i'm using lavender and lemon okay make sure you get perfume from a good source don't buy the ones that have already been diluted okay so this is not an essential oil this is just a fragrance oil you've already seen my bottles okay then um, this is my alcohol i'm using ethanol i'm using 600 ml of ethanol okay and then uh, this is my propylene glycol the propylene glycol is one that does the magic is one that make the fragrance last longer and of course my measuring cups okay then another thing i will need is my spatula okay i will need my spatula to mix in my perfume and <clears throat> And propylene glycol into my product then color color is optional for that color is still part of is still the alcohol my 800 ml of alcohol i fed small then added a little bit of color to it okay so it's not extra alcohol or one special color like that no okay so now we will start the first thing you do is of course you've already measured your your alcohol after measuring your alcohol you now pour in your perfume your alcohol should be 80 percent okay your alcohol should be 80 percent of your total uh, volume then your perfume should be 20 percent so now i'm making a total of about 800 mils okay but don't forget we are also adding propylene glycol and propylene glycol will add five percent so for my total volume of 800 mils i'll be using alcohol 600 mils my perfume will be 160 mils then my propylene glycol which i'm measuring now will be 40 mils that'll give me my total of 800 mils that will give you a standard perfume remember these fragrance oils as i said earlier on is not an essential oil and i think i've done a video on fragrance fragrance oils before okay you can check in my videos okay or i'll drop the link so that i'll be able to watch fragrance oils are not as safe as we see them okay they are not as safe so you will not want to use it too concentrated and that's why we have to dilute it with ethanol and then we also use our propylene glycol to make the scent stay a little bit longer okay and also it's not advisable to spray them directly on the skin although this has been diluted and ethanol is quite safe okay so after you've done that you mix it now this container i have is colored it has a pink coloring so what i'm doing is i'm pouring in in this container first without adding color because my color is blue the container is pink the product through the container might be looking somehow maybe purple because the container is a bit see-through you can see so i didn't add any color to this one now that I've poured in that one, I cannot add color and then pour into the other containers that are transparent. Okay. So essentially, it is the same product. But you know that the fact that that one is in that container, it will cost more because the container itself is a bit on the high side. The container alone is more than 500 Naira. So already you're paying up to 500 naira more than 500 naira alone for the 
container before the product. Now see the color that we are used. It looks like glacial blue. Okay. Glacial blue or icy. Looks icy kind of. Okay. It looks beautiful. So you dispense in all your containers. You cover them and then <clears throat> you can stick your labels on them. So as we were saying, if you're making this perfume with essential oils, that is pure essential oils. Generally for essential oils, you don't use essential oils for more than 1%. Because essential oils are stronger than fragrance oils. They might not scent as much, but they have more staying power. They are the type of fragrances that you, they will just, you not smell it much on a person, but they will stay longer. Something like wood, black wood, isn't it so? So see our final product. Thank you for watching.